Do you know Nnamdi Kanu is a billionaire in UK? See the churches he built and the list of students in his scholarship list. Eyewitness reveals. All right, my people, we greet all of you in this very content. This is the Lord TV. We greet you all benevolently, most especially this very Sunday. Um, we are saying a very big congratulations to you. Yes, it is. At least for seeing a special day like this, it is a thing of joy. We need to thank God. We will need to thank God. Um, for the um, February um, people, we are still uh, celebrating you people. In fact, day after day, we keep saying a word of prayer to all of them. Okay? And also, we are also appreciating them for staying tuned to our channel. Um, an eyewitness from the uh from uk i've tried hyping namde kano you know claiming that he is a billionaire so um nobody should try to let him down i think uh, he is saying this he said this when um uh uche mefo tried to embarrass himself Okay, try to make a caricature of Namdi Kanu that uh, Namdi Kanu is uh, is deceiving the people. Why why is he allowing them to sponsor his trip to the UK for his his treatments? Why can't he do it himself when he knows that he's capable? So this eyewitness is now you know taking it back as taking it back to Uchemefu to make a note that look this is who this man you uh, uh, this who this this is who this man is this is what he has done what he's still doing and who and what uh, and his what in the UK you understand well you will not know anyone not until when things happen then you don't know okay so this person is this person and all of that let's clear hear him and know what he actually means by that very statement this is today's news an eyewitness by name oji uzotema has claimed that nam the kanu is a billionaire is a noiseless fellow he is very quiet and easy going. Namdi Kano is someone that if you know him, you know someone. They call him Mazi Okukano because of his personality and easy goingness. Namdi Kano has built several churches which he donated to many pastors in UK. These churches never belong to him, but belong to these parishioners. Namde Kano trains many students in their studies. He is the eyes of many evils and also the sponsors of many less privileged. I can vouch and I can speak of what I know about him. Now that he's in detention, in fact, these people are suffering like no tomorrow. He has pleaded that all should understand the position of Unam de Kano and try to give him a space and the opportunity to return back to the UK. This eyewitness has slammed Uchemefo, claiming that Unam de Kano has all that it takes to get himself treated if given the opportunity. The federal government are only acting too smart and difficult to handle but then i know that the ipop leader will soon be out of detention it's a question of time he claimed thank you so much my people in fact i'm very happy that um, we are um, inform some informations are being let out to us now 
I think uh, someone also reviewed Unamricano's net worth. Net worth and um, what he actually worth in the UK. Uh, Donald Trump, before his, his, uh, his retirement, he also tried to uh, review Unamricano's position and also who Unamricano is, is as well. Um, you see, you don't call Keto Black when the Black has not really dealt with you. What has Namdekano really done that is making them to call him all these kind of names? Okay, look at this eyewitness that spoke now. Even uh, he, he, he has made it known to us and he has made and he has revealed it that Namdekano is this person, but it's, he has refused to make it publicized that this is who he is this is what he has and this is what he wants you understand that is how you know who is humble he is humble to the finish and if you look at it you will see that it is true it is true all the why that aside the kuba has been slamming and and hitting on him he he just kept calm he, he, he never uttered a word until he was captured or, or, and arrested you see that Look at during the period of COVID-19. It was Nam the Kanu that took that that took it on himself and say, "My people will not die of hunger." Then he tried to co contact the other um, uh, uh, evil men in diaspora. So together and col collaboratively, they you know make provisions and send down to Nigeria for the evils to have something with them so my dear listeners i think we have spoken at length um let me hear from you and let me know what you as well think of what has just been reviewed don't forget your comments they are still very much of great importance don't forget to leave them below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to receive more updates thank you